know, this fellow walks up to me on the street and he asks for a few cents. I haven't eaten in three days, he tells me. Why not, I ask, and he replies, me wife hocked me teeth. Ah, oh, you poor soul, I says. And then he looks at me and says, Oh, Bister, have pity, and please hear me ditty. I'm the fellow who married Big Molly O'Toole. Whenever she necks me, she practically wrecks me. She got muscles and biceps like an old army mule. Alive, alive, oh-ho, I'm barely alive, oh-ho, since the day that I married Big Molly O'Toole. Ah, Molly O'Toole. That's a girl. That's what everyone asks me. That's a girl? Molly's got everything. Bad breath, lousy complexion, eyes as big as saucers, and underneath the cups to go with them. And what a shape, like the coastline of New Jersey. But I think she's a little plump around Bayonne. And what a sense of humor. When we go to the movies, she likes to drop things over the balcony. You know, like candy, popcorn, billiard balls, ushers. <laughs> I'll never forget the first time I seen Molly. She was stuffing a goose. She was stuffing it down her kid brother's throat. Molly was luscious. In fact, she's one of the biggest luscious in town. I guess that's why we were engaged so long. I wouldn't marry her when she was drunk, and she wouldn't marry me when she was sober. Uh, so like I was saying, the first time I seen Molly, she was out at the beach. There she was in waiting. There she stood with the water an inch above her knees and her knees an inch above her ankles. What a beauty. She had long black hair growing all the way down her back. And her head, nothing. And what a face, like a phonograph record. Round, flat, and full of lines. She got what they call a peaches and cream complexion. Like somebody hit her in the face with a breakfast tray. Molly had the kind of face that made you look down and the kind of feet that made you look up. She got one eye, one ear, and one finger. She was a single girl. That's true, she only had one eye. Her mother was scared by a motorcycle. She's the only girl I've ever seen with buck lips. She could kiss you and wash your face at the same time. Ah, uh, I'll never forget the night I asked her to marry me. I, I, I could hardly speak. That's how tight her fingers were around my throat. And on her wedding night, it was lovely. Molly whisked me up and carried me over the threshold. I only wish she'd have opened the door first. Now there's no more to tell. I'm not feeling well. Since the day that I married Big Molly O'Toole. Even her muscles got muscles. Big Molly O'Toole.